put on the video, tell on the video, this is service. Your yeah. realtor is giving you really good service. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the front of the house, Roberta. I'll do a, a neighborhood scan to give you an idea of the homes. This is a gated community, so you won't have people just kind of passing through. It's only about, I think, two, two streets, so it's a small community, but you're real close to I-77, so you can get back to Charlotte, or you're still two hours from Charleston to fly out of Charleston if you need to. Coming in, little front porch. You do have, so have your garage. Coming in the front door, good size foyer. You go straight upstairs. So area over here as well. Right off the foyer is the garage. They have some stuff in there. You can still fit your your car in here. And they have some extra storage in there as well. Off the foyer, we have the half bath downstairs and your laundry room as well. A little half bath, washer and dryer all downstairs. Very easy and convenient for you. And then you also have a coat closet opposite of the half bath to give you an idea. And straightforward is an open floor plan. You have your kitchen to the right. And there will be a similar refrigerator. The one in the video does not convey. The one that's in the garage will convey with the house. You have a kitchen area, a bar area here, your dining area there. And I'll scroll around to the family room. Now I'm standing in the kitchen. And there is your fireplace, which is gas burning fireplace. And then that's to the backyard. And I'll give you a different angle. Standing inside the family room. Give you an idea the eating kitchen area, dining room. And you do have the smooth ceilings. Fans, and now we will take you upstairs. Here's another view of the foyer, nice size foyer. You can get a little table in there, a clock, or several other little items in there. And heading upstairs, the carpet looks to be in good condition, so you should be fine. As you come upstairs, there's a a right and the left. We'll go to the right first. Let's see. Put on some lights for you. But coming to the right, you have a full bathroom, single sink. Floors are in good condition. And you have a, a fiberglass tub, which is fine. Come back out to the secondary bedrooms. This is a good sized bedroom. You see they have a, I guess like a triple bunk bed in here, or like a quadruple bunk bed in here. So they have a lot of space. So you can definitely get a full or queen size bed in here. We still have a little cutout over here for a dresser. And the double doors. For a closet space, and you still have a ceiling fan in this one as well. Right next door, this one's a little bit smaller. They have a setup for more of a TV room with this a couch and a TV, but this is a bedroom. You do have a closet over here. And then down the hallway into the master bedroom. And this one is a long master bedroom, so you have a lot of room here. 
the front door you have a ceiling fan was to the right so your bed could go there you can have your bed in the center where it's at here or over here and there's a good bit of distance from the door to the bed you still got about you know five six feet from the bed to the door here's a different angle of the room and I think they said this room is about 24 feet long about 14 15 feet wide so it's a pretty big master bedroom and there I am hello and that side you have your walk-in closet and we'll step into the master bedroom and you have a single sink linen closet over there your toilet area and a nice size soaking tub with the shower and then again you have the smooth so everything is nice and modern and then here is your walk-in closet and I'll take a right now the owner is actually out back with his grandkids but you do have a fenced in yard and they got a little puppies on the trampoline but you do have a fenced in yard well partially fenced in yard let me correct myself partially fenced in yard and then behind you are looks like um, townhomes are behind you or apartment complexes behind you we will go back downstairs James, can I go in the backyard? Yeah. Okay. Okay, and the built-ins on the um, garage, if she wants those out, mm -hmm. we can get those pulled out. I think if you want the trampoline, you'll... Trampoline, how much you want that? I'll, I'll ask her to see. <laughs> Backyard, give you a little side view. Oh, they do have a little catwalk to walk to the backyard. But here's a view of the backyard. It's partially fenced in, and that's their little doggies on the trampoline. So you have to add a gate where I'm at. And fence it in. You can add a fence from that satellite dish to the trash can, and it can be fenced in very easily. But here is a view of the back of the house. And there's still plenty of room to have fun back here. And if you want the trampoline, I can get that to stay too. I'll send this to you. Let me know what you think. Thanks. Bye.